Hi, this is Donna Karen Ho, and you're watching Art Center TV. <laughs> oh my god, cut it. So, the final product, I guess you can say, for this project that I um, ended up with for this time being is I decided to make zines. Um, I made 20 zines and I titled the zine Donna's Eye. I titled it Donna's Eye because it just makes sense to me because, um, you know, while I was photographing these drag queens, I wasn't myself, I was in drag, so um, it was more of like you know, Donna's photographic eye, so when you think of Donna's eye, it's just like, oh, this is what she sees, and then this is her life, and, um, yeah, I just thought it made sense at the time. Um, unfortunately, I can't show you a copy of the zine right now, because they were just ordered, and they will be here, um, a couple days after, um, soon, but, <laughs> yeah, but I, there's like a little mock-up that I made up, um, that, like I just it was like, kind of it was kind of difficult to put together. I just, I just kind of sort of just like laid it out all on my floor and did some like really like really janky like looking ink, like printer like weird paper. Um, but um, I mean that's all you need when you're laying something out anyway. But um, I'm happy and excited for people to see the zine. Um, I've never like really done a project like this before. Um, but I'm just so excited because I know that, like, it's a tangible product and, like, people are gonna, like, it's something that's takeaway, so it's, like, kind of, like, promotional, like, you're like, oh, here, look at, look at this, look what I can do, look at me. <laughs> um, I think the biggest thing that I learned from doing this project was, uh, was, I think it's just how to be more comfortable with myself, and by that I mean, finally being comfortable with being a feminine man, which is something that I've always kind of struggled with and kind of felt ashamed of, but um, I think with this project it really helped me grow and be, I don't know, more brave and more outspoken and um, I, I feel like I'm taking little bits and pieces of Donna with me into my boy form. <laughs> um, but. I also learned a lot about just like acceptance in general of like all kinds of like different types of art and photography like if you would have asked me like four years ago if I would ever shoot like on camera flash like work or I would probably be like are you kidding me <laughs> but no it's just it really opened my eyes to like different types of work and I started looking at different kinds of photographers I had, like, never thought to look at before, and, um, yeah, just, yeah, acceptance, just acceptance of, like, you know, drag queens are people, too, they're just, everyone's a person, we're like human beings, we all deserve to be treated with kindness in this world, and, um, I think that's one of the biggest things I learned. Pretty soon I'm just gonna be way more comfortable with, with doing things that I want to do and not really be so sheltered and scared and I think it's so great that I'm realizing this my, my last term, my graduating term at Art Center because I felt like I didn't feel like myself at all. I mean I felt very pushed into a box and I know that a lot of people don't understand and have not understand and probably still don't understand why I do what I do but that's okay, because, I mean, I'm still going to do what I want to do anyway, whether it be photography or drag or dancing, whatever I want to do, and I just hope that people will be as supportive as my family has been with this whole journey. and. 
I just hope people don't ignore it. This is this is who I am. Are we done? Yeah, we're done. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> it's so hot.